um, journalists, uh, people planting for ground, where wrong, where it become covered the event. But what didn't happen? We see immediately when we come the federal high court, um, then we come away. Um, but before that session, in the enter court, and then we look at then look at in case and the federal government arena. But before we go, I will tell us say um, the minister of justice Malami being informed the Nigerian media and the Nigerian people say um, them being work with the security agencies they say they work with their serious work with security agencies to ensure say they return Umnandi Kanu back we don't already know the influence of Umnandi Kanu and waiting the activities where in Dundee do as person where they support the separatist group IPOP and the government they say that group they know support they don't prescribe and say no be better group and that government they intentionally they ready to um make sure say that's their, their demand no 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 succeed because of say them say them want biafra and sick of that that's why um the nigerian government don't they take tea, um don't they involve with nadi kanu issue they don't arena for court federal high court here with 11 count charges where uh, him be no answer and run away today for court now we'll go waiting um Ogamalami talk tell journalists before um they bring and come court. Ogamalami say if we want to inform Nigeria and say the Nigerian government with security agencies don't succeed to map Nandi Kanu today. And truly, truly today he come court and he appear before court be before um justice Binta Nyako. Yeah, one minute, one minute please. Yeah. So Sorry, I want to record this. Can you wait? Which one? Which I'm one? Using, are you? We don't see any of the lawyers, but um, we get no. one of our uh, person where see where enter where they inside the court, oh, yeah. where see the matter as see they happen. Okay. Okay. Can you can you tell us your name? Can you... My name is Eric Ikelai. I am a journalist with the Nation newspaper. Okay, you were in the court, you were at the court courtroom yes. when, where the um the Kanu was arraigned. Can you tell us what he, has happened? He wasn't arraigned. Okay. He was brought to court by the DSS and um, the lawyer to the government told the court that the man Kanu had been at large, that he was granted bail earlier in 2017, but since then he jumped bail and has flouted the bail conditions. So he now applied that Kano be remanded in the custody of the DSS and that the trial be accelerated so that the case can be concluded on time. The case was initially adjourned till October 20th. But by his application, the court brought the trial back to July 26th and ordered that he be remanded in the custody of the DSS pending then. And as, in, and as the uh, prosecuting lawyer to inform the defendant, the, defendant uh, the lawyer to the defendant so that they can attend court at the next date. And then after proceedings, Kanu sought the permission of the court to talk and said he was absent in court. He has been absent in court because his house was invaded by some people who killed some people and that he didn't want to uh, be killed. That was why he has not been able, that's why he went on that ground and not been able to attend court. Like, it wasn't that he deliberately um, absented himself from court. So the court told him to liaise with, with his lawyer so that he can prepare for the subsequent Can you please proceedings. describe um, what kind of looked like when you saw him today? He looked okay. He was clean shaven. Although he was brought in court earlier, booted, they removed the hood and he was looking well. He was dressed in black uh, track suit. Do you see him? You know him. I, I that know was him. I the saw he had little medium like the one <laughs> that is white, that is grey, grey. So he looks well, okay, and he spoke well. He looked healthy. So what did he say? 
<laughs> okay, so um, now waiting are the few things where we will get, um, you know, different from so many things where we don't talk for here. Uh, we don't hear, say, then see and koro koro. So for many of now where they say, ah, if we don't see in face, I will not say we will believe say, namna the canoe. True, true, we don't get person where see and koro koro. Say in day clean shaved, in day calm, in wear black track suit, and then get small game for, 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 for where you carry. And so in day calm, and he tell to the court, he get, he tell court, made and grant him access to talk and in talk. So from the 26th, we will see, say, this, the speedy trial will begin. And um, we're going to see how um, people go to talk about um, how the issue go to go and how quick they go accelerate the trial. Um, this is not very, um, is a landmark, um, will be landmark trial for this country where so many people, both international and local people, go one look out for to see the outcome of how this go play out in the next coming days. And we from the BBC Pigeon, we go day here, we they give on a tour as they happen live from the Federal High Court of Nigeria. Now, how much where we go take, now the much where we go take from... Um... Anyway, my people, when I don't watch the video, Welcome back again. Thank you so much. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, share, and like our videos. My returning viewers, thank you. So that's now from BBC Pigeon. They say they don't arrest the leader of IPOB, Nam Dekano. Mazi Nam Dekano. But I never see when and where and how they go arrest person. They will come to talk on behalf of the person. We never see the person for high. And they say now since on Sunday, how many days ago, now they arrest and carry and come Ninja. So before we go believe, we want to see Nam Dekano with our Koro Koro highs for inside Ninja courts. Before we go believe. Even if they arrest and serve, no be big deal. I trust Bia France. Nam Dekano no go stay there for a long time. Lie lie. Then they, they are back, 247, that's one, Gidigba. I know they fear for that one. But come to think of it, why they go arresting Amdekanu? How many Fulani S men they don't arrest? How many Boko Haram made they Koro Koro, they destroy people? We don't see how many people Boko Haram don't remove their neck, including pastors mm -hmm. for that part of the Niger, the northern part. We don't know how many Christian pastors Boko Haram don't remove their neck. So... What did Nam Dekanu really do? Biafrans, they don't get anything like a gun, over knife, but they don't get. But the heads men, Koro Koro, heads men, they go carry gun, go they walk out for afternoon, Koro Koro, I they see high. What did our people do? What did the politicians do? What did the leaders do? What did the president do? Why it can't be safe for Nigeria? Some people get freedom to do anything. Why some people no fit cough? The Biafrans, even their common t shirt they just wear Biafra t shirt no problem. You carry Biafran flag, put for your car, no problem. But, Hesmen go carry gun, koro, koro. They go leave them. Gun and flag. Flag made they harmless. They go arrest you because you carry flag or wear t shirt or wear cap. Maybe Biafra. Huh? But, Hesman, they say they legalize them for them. They feel carry gun, what can nothing go happen? Which kind of country will they live like this inside? Which kind of country? Time never reach me, they go divide this country because the injustice, eh? It did too annoying. It did too annoying. Truth. See the way that they treat people. Who feel do who, which Igbo man go go kill Aousa man for in country, for in state? Which Yoruba man go go kill Aousa man for in state? Why be saying outside get the freedom and liberty to do anything? Because Nigeria belongs to them according to them. Mm -hmm. They say Nigeria na their prop na their papa property. Now they get them, nothing will happen. I beg this country, they so annoying. What in them they cannot do? What thing they do all this while now mountain just they talk? I never see where in them they cannot share guns for people. I never see where in them they cannot share bullets I've been a bomb. But with a C Koro Koro, with they see the way that they supply guns and bomb everything to, to the Boko Arams. With they see the one that they supply the S men. So what do they talk for here? I mean only those people get the right to carry guns, waka, and to kill any person they like. Which kind of country like this will they lead? 
They don't go share this country now by force to be one Nigeria. Bia France won't go. Odudu was want to go. May them go in peace. The Nigeria no fit be one again. It don't tame it, don't scatter. Which kind of country? Since Buhari became the president, now only the Northerners, now them, they fit kill anybody they like, fit carry any money they like, fit do anything they like. Which kind of thing be this one? I beg, I they provoke my people. Now the latest be this. I go to keep on updated. I go to tell on what they happen. As the news they come, I go to share and come. They say they don't arrest her. We still the hope. May we see what if not him they arrest or in shadow or in spirit or not just uh, propaganda. We are watching. And even if not him, why? Which offense? How many Boko Haram they catch? May they leave, may they keep him for prison or carry and come court. Maybe they catch Boko Haram tomorrow. They go say they don't repent. Uh, may they go tr treat them. May they go take care of them. Uh, what did they do? No normal. Uh, they need to carry them go rehabilitation center. The, you know, Boko Haram, oh, if you see the they, they treat them, pay them salary, pamper them, say well done, say you do well. But what did Nam Dikano do? May they carry and go court. How many Boko Haram they don't carry come court? Maybe if they catch them, they, they carry them go rehabilitation center. If really say they catch in the canoe, make them do the same the way that they do Boko Haram. Make them pay them salary as they pay Boko Haram. Carry and go rehabilitation center too. Because, Abi, I beg this country, no balance, I beg.